COVID-19, the role of science during the pandemic. Chapter 1, investigating a new type of virus. In late 2019, a new type of coronavirus began to spread across the world. The spread would have a huge impact on every area of society and of our lives. In early 2020, SARS-CoV-2 was named and identified as the cause of the illness COVID-19. On March 11, 2020, the World Health Organization declared the outbreak of the coronavirus a pandemic. To save lives, scientists had to rapidly investigate the as yet unknown strain of coronavirus. Means and resources were made available worldwide in order to achieve swift results. In addition to determining the origin of the virus, they also needed to understand modes of transmission and reproduction rates in order to tackle the spread of the virus effectively. Scientists of all nations and disciplines joined forces to gain a better understanding of the virus. Developing vaccines received special priority. Vaccines used to fight illnesses can be based either on viral vectors or on living or dead cultures. For COVID-19, an additional mode of vaccine was newly investigated, one that had originally been developed to combat cancer. Due to the substantial existing fundamental research, the so-called mRNA vaccine could be modified to apply to COVID-19. At the same time, scientists were working worldwide to find solutions to the economic, civic and societal challenges brought about by the corona pandemic. The importance of international cooperation in combating the pandemic became clear. Nobel laureate Robert J. Schiller describes the role of new interdisciplinary perspectives during a health crisis. There's a lot of insights that you need to understand a crisis like this. Uh, for example, epidemiology, I think, should be a bigger part of uh, economics. Uh, and uh, we can learn from the past that past episodes uh, were not only disease epidemics, but they were epidemics of ideas. Uh, narratives that changed uh, because of the epidemic. 